Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zlot, and I'm here on the GTI server, Alpha 7, and we are on the moon, on Akua's moon, anyway. So yeah, last episode you saw us warp uh, a couple times from Ningas and then over to the moon expecting to find a whole bunch of Metaxid and so they've changed that a little bit there are little deposits little crystals of it that you can go grab individually like before but not in as big a clusters um, but there are deposits of it and I'm having a tough time finding an unprotected deposit. I've only found one so far and there's like a POI really close to it. A shooty, uh, a, a shoot you in the head POI. So I've been wandering around with the CV and I think I'm gonna have to take my HV out and just and just pick them by hand as I see them. Uh, maybe mine up some Prometheum and, and I don't know uh, what do I really need silicone and copper at this point so so if I if I don't stumble across some pentaxid I'll pick what I can and um, pick up some some cobalt and silicone so I think that's what our plan is today we're gonna take the uh, the hover box mark two out um, that was a fan suggestion name for it so I published that up to the where are the uh, sorry the workshop <laughs> couldn't think of the word okay so there we go it's still it's still kind of a tin can so uh, keep that in mind it's not like there's no sathium in it so it's just it's just a cheap tin can but it's better than the hover box was it is the hover box still it's just got a big a whole bunch of metal around it now okay let's do this then let's uh, make sure we've got some fuel and oxygen and some food we've got a, should we take more we've still got tons of emergency I think we'll be fine I think we'll be just fine so let's jump up here and apparently as you can see I still haven't learned how to jump it's oh because we're on super low gravity that's why okay So it looks all scratched up and well, looks all nice and scratched up inside, as you can see. Uh, I actually kind of really dig that. Um, I don't know some people might not like it, but I like it. So let's uh, get this thing out there, working for us. So I think what we need to do is. get these ones right here right away so maybe they'll spawn again by the time we come back so I'll let me just um, get the hover to about here I'm just gonna lower it down and it's self-defending by the way with its turrets that's that's the one thing I really like about hovers is they are self-defending if you have got the turret set up properly on them Okay, so let's jump out. And get this stuff. Not really too worried about equipping a gun. There's no real wildlife. Now, I've never actually really mined any of the rocks on the moon. Yeah, crushed stone, iron ore. So, yeah, that's... Same sort of thing, you can... Yeah. So they're probably just regular, regular rocks for what you get out of them. Yep. Yep. So that's a viable way of getting uh, re lots of resources too, because look at all the rocks. I mean, it's just... You know, I could go park out in the middle of these things with my... HV and like I am and just use my drone but you can't pick the crystals with the drone so 
you have no choice. You got to get out and do it. So let's just uh, let's concentrate on that. I want to take the HV out mining. Actually, I don't really want to mine by hand right now. And I think the moon should be as good as place as any to mine, right? Right. I was hoping for pentaxid, but we'll um, we'll take some copper and silicone right now. So we'll just head back to the HV. And why don't I have any cava on me? I don't get it. I do. Because <laughs> I'm derping, that's why. And I jumped right over, didn't I? Oh, oh recovered. Okay. So how much did we get there? That was a quick five refined into ten. So we need more. <laughs> a lot more. <sighs> okay, so the pentaxid is seeming to be elusive. I wonder if it would be easier to find the deposits on Akua. Because I seem to remember when I tested it doing Akua, I didn't have as big of an issue. But, I don't know. Looks like I'm far enough away from that POI. What was that? Was that a... I have no idea. Hmm. Okay. Is that the crash? No, because I... If I know what it is, it would be marked on my map right now. So it's something, something I haven't gotten close enough to. Nor do I really want to. So it looks like there's rocks with the pentaxid crystals. Okay, what I want to do is just inch my way. If I see it starting to shoot, I run. come too far. Oh! No, I see light. I see some kind of flashes. I'm not sure. It's freaking me out. Freaking me out. I don't see missiles coming at me. Uh... Is it just lighting playing tricks on me? That might be all it is. Yeah. So when I'm really paranoid about distances to POIs, I mean, I, I'm, I know I'm pretty safe here. <clears throat> it's not even close enough to even come close to having the name show up. So, and I can't even see any drones or nothing around it. But what I'll do. Uh, instead of just jumping out of my vehicle, I'll, I'll dismount, and of course I'm in my, my box top style vehicle, so turn my light on, and I'll actually spawn my drone. Come on, just a quick little <laughs> jump out, spawn my drone, and what I'll do is I'll, I'll go forward with my drone and see if it'll actually fire at my drone past to where I'm going to be stepping out at and if if it doesn't then I'm fine so I'm fine I'm gonna have to make more cava I'm gonna go through cava a lot I think trying to get pentaxid <laughs> But on the moon is a good place for it, because you don't stay overheated for long. Oh, 
Oh, really? That one ripped me off. Oh, well. That's the last of those anyway. Oh, hurry up. <laughs> I can't have it. I have to run. Sorry. I can't just not run. And I can't jump either, apparently. <laughs> okay. Okay, we've all witnessed how badly I can jump. It's not good. Um, damn it. Darn. Sorry. I'm trying not to uh, bring out the nasty words. But this lack of pentaxid is disturbing. I've only found one so far. And it's guarded. Meh. I might have to fly down to the planet. Ugh. I didn't really want to. I suppose I could do the Akua quest down there, right? Right? Do the village quests and all that? Huh. You know, that's not... That's not a bad idea. What do you th what do you think? I think I think we should do that. I think we should do that. We we got a little bit of pent now. I mean, eleven that'll grind up into twenty two. It's not like we're stranded or anything. Now, did I pick these? I don't think I did. They don't look picked. Now, is there a trick to these ones? Do they glow the same as before if they're not picked? I think they do. Right? And I can't see. I don't even know if that's a shooty POI. That might be a civilian POI. Anyway, it's just it's taking too long. Oops. It's taking too long, so I'm just going to grab this one and be done with the moon. And I'm actually going to be wiping the orbit playfield on Omicron and Akua because... Um, which I didn't realize was... For some reason, on publish, the the um, publish release, the published version uh, had a bunch of Neo in Neo and Sath in the orbit of Akua and Omicron in the multiplayer. So they stripped that out, and I'm going to have to wipe our server to replace the play fields or not wipe the server but just wipe those play fields save files and templates so that I can so that next time they load it'll load from the updated scenario that I'm gonna be updating with the new newly fixed um, YAMLs but you know what it's an alpha we have to expect these things <clears throat> don't get mad at at bugs and stuff like that, just report them. Okay. Well, uh, not very successful. I would say going to the moon. Shut the door. Born in a barn? Jeez. Kids nowadays. Okay, let's get our <laughs> night sight off here. It's like, why is everything so... Oh, yeah. It's looking, like looking in one of my old monitors. Monochrome monitors. I'm dating myself. Okay, so let's fire up our engines and get out of here. Literally, we're just gonna take off on out of here. I mean, I guess we could have explored the capital vessel. Eh. Really, I want Pentaxid right now. Uh, 
I want to find me a place that's safe to live. And I know it exists in this galaxy somewhere, this solar system. I'm just gonna find it. I can't do that without Pataxin. take the auto brakes off and I'm just going to take my finger off the thrust and just enjoy the cruise and kind of look around as we glide through the galaxy do little spins around da, 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 da. I like I like uh, turning the auto brake off and just cruising and looking around you don't get to do that as much while you're driving so it's kind of kind of something that passengers get to do so we're going to do that right now and just enjoy the panoramic scenery of the asteroid field and oh crap what's that no <laughs> jesus okay Run, run away! Okay, wow. Um, okay. Pay attention, Z. <laughs> God. Fly into an enemy days. Do, 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 do. S smelling the roses on the way. <laughs> So, yeah, maybe sometimes you... What, it's gonna self-destruct? No, it, it's, I don't know why it gives that message when it's done its cycle or whatever it is. So, we should, uh, eh, we don't need to really check out Tia Sakua, do we? Hmm. Okay, I gotta be careful. What I want to do is I want to find a large body of water to go down into the middle of, because that way... jitteriness. I have my settings on medium now just to get a little bit better video quality so it's not so now that looks dangerous. That looks really dangerous. Let's not get too, too close to that. So there's some smaller lakes over here. Probably okay if we came down in the middle of one of the smaller lakes, maybe. Oh, there's a big lake over here. It's just that my dumb luck is I, I come down on top of the drone base all the time. So if I come down on top of water, I'm not going to come down on top of the drone base, right? Like, literally, it seems like every time, the first time I go to a play field and I enter it, I enter it directly on top of the drone base. I don't know what that is. It's some weird... <sighs> we'll have to see if that happens to me in this series. Oh, it did already, didn't it? Uh, like last episode, even. <laughs> Coming down into the moon. Right? Right? It did. Yeah. God. <sighs> okay, I'm just... I know I'm... 
you know, I'm kind of fudging myself over to this lake, but I mean, seriously, this is a tin box. It's a cigar freaking tube. I'm in a, an aluminum cigar tube. Seriously. Um, anytime. Okay, anytime. That's usually a bad sign. Oh, see you on top of the drone base. No! <laughs> oh, stop it! On top of the drone base! <laughs> You gotta be kidding me! I don't know, but well. Wow, what is that? That could be the drone base. Maybe a new drone base for Akua? I don't know. There's some POIs over there. Sorry, I'm flying upside down. I know, I just. It's easier to see. <laughs> And that's why you put even amount of thrusters in every direction so that you can actually fly in every direction at the same speed with whatever thrusters you need to. Huh. Well, let's come down. Let's get a little closer here. What's that over there? Is that, a, is that a base? A POI or something? Level off. Now, realistically, this should be safe here as I just check out some things here. So, uh, all the basics. There's no Pentax in here. So it's only on the moon. Okay. Hmm. Wonder if there's any in the lakes. I can't remember. I don't think there is. Can you see any? is rocks that I'm smashing into. <laughs> oh. Got a drone over there. I'm like bottoming out in the water. I don't think this is very deep. That's kind of a drag. I don't know what that is. If that's a 2D POI or not, I don't trust it. Oh, what's red over here? What's red over here? It's that. It's a thing. Kind of a thing, is it? Is it a shooty POI? I can't tell. Let's do our night sight. Sweet home. Ah, okay, so it's uh, other player bases. Nice. their resources I don't need to I guess I might have to go back to the moon then for pent damn I was hoping there's some on Akua That's a lot more difficult getting pent now. 
I'm just wondering if the deposits are like massive deposits or something. It's like you mine it once and you're good forever. Because I see no pent here. Yeah, I'm treating my CV like crap, but I wouldn't do it on a PvP so much because it would get all bent up. Hmm. But it's a PvE planet, so. Um. I don't know. I don't really know what to do now. I guess I gotta go back to the moon. That really sucks. That really sucks. Let's let's check our map here. Okay, so we've got Akua Moon has Pentaxidus deposit. The orbit does not. It has Sathium Neo and Prometheum. Hmm. Now we could grind up our pent that we got and easily make it to Skillion, but I don't know what Skillion has. And I'd rather have enough to make a round trip, and I don't think we do. <sighs> Back to the moon it is. Sorry guys for wasting your guys' time, but hey! We came and checked out Akua and traveled around the out in space a bit, so not all is lost. But we are in darkness the whole time. Sorry about that. I'm on a mission though. I need to find Pen. This is... This is becoming... I mean, it never used to be a huge issue before. Now it's actually kind of difficult. There's obviously a uh, Sathium over there. Ooh. Ooh. Let's check out this meteorite over here. I know this won't be here when I wipe it, and I I think for that sake it's not gonna be it's not gonna be fair if I mine this right now, because it's not gonna be available to anyone else when I wipe this playfield. So, in all fairness, I'm not going to mine it as much as I so want to right now. Oh my god, I so much want to. But I could go back to Ninguez and do Sath and Neo if I really, really want to, and I might do that. Because Ninguez, I think, is going to have easier crystals to find, too. Oh, what's going on here? What's going on? Oh, we got... We might have incoming here. Okay, I don't have problems killing these guys, though. I don't have issues with that. I'll gladly kill them. Is he running away from me? No, he's turning around. He's turning around. Way too late. Okay, let's, uh... Let's loot this guy. So, uh, I'm going to turn my jetpack on, or else I'm just going to be stuck. It doesn't really matter anyway. Uh, let's just eject and get my drone out. And we just. The door is still open from last time. Whoops. Guess I am born, born in a barn. And, woo, look at all those goodies. Oh my god, power coils, capacitor devices, and Thanos. Wow, and cool. And, oh wait, I am, I am out of them. Oh, holy crap. That was. That was insane. That was, um. Wow, that was over the top loot. Over the top loot. Yeah. Each of those oscill oscillators take like five Neo to make. So ten right there is like 50 Neo worth of... <laughs> oh. You can see why it didn't take me much. And and how many... What? Let's... Okay, let's look at what it actually gave me here. 
five capacitor devices. There's 20 Neo in each of those. If you put that into a factory, that's a hundred freaking Neo worth. Um, that's 50 Neo worth. There's 150 Neo. Oh, and oh, flux coil, three power coils. Like, oh, come on. Way over the top, Luke. Way, way, way over the top. Please. A third that amount. A third. Not even. Okay. So. Hmm. Hmm. Since I'm not going to go for the Neo and Sath here, and there's no Pentaxid, that's easy enough. I'm going to head back to Ninga's. I'm going to head back to Ninga's. Um, Akua's just not doing it for me. The moon, I couldn't find the, the other ones. So, we'll do Ninga's. So, 15 AU. That means I got to go into my advanced constructor, or well, it doesn't really matter. Put that in there and grind all that up, and we'll just throw all this in there. Oh, actually, I don't want to throw more in there. I'll put the stone in. I don't care, but the ore. No. Parts in, yes. Stone is fine. At least you get two per, so that's good. So 24. It's going to cost us 15. Uh, we're going to have nine left. Oh, I'm not sure what I have in the tank. I might have some in the tank, too. Let me just put the stuff in there for now. And let's go into here, and we're going to... So I had one. So we're up to 25. So we'll have 10 left. Ugh. If I get stranded in Ningas, that would suck. But I have a feeling I can pick it on the planet. It used to be able to... used to be able to so I think I think we're just gonna do it oh there was uh was that like a drone that just spawned beside me or is that the the one I had killed probably the one I killed right okay so now the the orbit around Ninga is looking for stuff is just atrocious. Now what is here again? There is copper, cobalt, neo, sathium, promethium, iron, and magnesium. Hmm. So, Sathian Prometheus. No, I knew that was supposed to be like that. So that's, I, I don't have a deal uh, issue getting Sathium and Neo from Ningas. Well, if that's what we got to do, that's what we got to do and pick some pent on the way, I guess. We got to get a whole bunch of pent. So, now... I have an option. I could take the box top clap trap and do all that. Or I could risk parking the CV and getting it shot up by the planetary vessel. But I'd have the HV down there if I did that and could mine really fast. Uh, I don't think it's worth taking a risk for. So I think at this point, I'm just going to fly further away from the planet out 
to about 10,000 and see if um, see if there's anything out there that could potentially be dangerous to sh and that would shoot up my CV. I just don't want to deal with another CV as all. Well. It can defend itself against drones as long as they don't come at it from underneath, I guess. Although the front the front turrets are point up straight up and down if they need to. So Okay, so we're probably good here. Okay. I still got some food on me. Let me uh pound that. I'm actually gonna need more than that now. So let's do the fridge and Oh, I should have ate the ratatouille. Well, sure, we'll take 10. We'll just throw it in the fridge. And, oh, you know what I should do? I should turn off the engines. There we go. Okay. So we're going to head out with the SV. So just this little cheap one here. Oh, before I do that, let's make sure I have this set to my home spawn. Yes, okay. Because that would suck having to do a fresh start and leaving my CV here. <laughs> that could happen. I could totally, I could see myself derping like that and doing that. Okay, so let's just to get down as low as possible before actually entering the cockpit so that oh, turn my turn that off for now fine okay so let's we've got bullets good we'll fill it with oxygen we'll fill it with fuel oh. it's got a peeny little tank I think okay That's okay. That'll work just fine. So let's go. Um, just back out here, over top of the other vehicles. Maybe, no. <laughs> okay, let's turn this on and see what derpage I'm doing. And it looks like, oh, because I'm on such a horrible angle so I need to go like this a little bit and I still might not be able to because I'm pointing down too much yeah okay so <laughs> pointing down too much it doesn't look like I was pointing down I don't know it's deceiving anyway let's just go let's just go oh I can't again <laughs> am I, what am I hitting there we go God, I'm scratching the paint too because this is probably PvP. Oh, wait, I am dying. I am dying. Why am I dying? That's not good. That's not good. Why is this thing not sealed? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Okay, Stickus. <laughs> I have issue with your design. <sighs> what? Are you kidding me? Okay, so the oxygen is going? How is that even possible if... <sighs> I don't get it. How is that possible? Oxygen is turned on. <gasps> oh, you know what it was? I didn't let it heat up long enough, I bet, right? Right? Maybe? Okay, 
let's try this again. So it's okay. So stop it. No, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> I want to jump in the cockpit. Thank you. Okay, now we gotta go through this again. <laughs> God, come on, let me. <laughs> Did you see that? I uh, suffocating in there with the head jumping. Are you kidding me? Watch, watch. Yep, yep, no oxygen. <laughs> no oxygen. But oh, it's, I'm okay now. Uh... <sighs> okay, guys. Well, we tried. Kinda. Um, but there was no do. There was do not. There was only do not. There was no try. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, it was an epic fail. I'm gonna, off camera, fix the SV so that next episode we can go out and farm Pentaxid and Neo and Sath on Ningas. Okay, guys. You have an awesome day.